Hey guys, DC Network here, coming at you with another video. There's been a lot of news coming out of Warner Brothers Discovery over the past week. First, we had the announcement that Multiverses is going to get shut down over at Warner Brothers Discovery and relaunched. Then we got the announcement that Unicorn Wars Eternal is coming out very soon, but it's no longer going to be releasing on Cartoon Network in favor of releasing on Adult Swim. Then we had another announcement saying that My Adventures with Superman is getting the same fate as Unicorn Wars Eternal. It's coming at some point this year, but no no longer on Cartoon Network, now it's coming to Adult Swim. And the icing on the cake to all of that is Michael Ololin in an article to Deadline spoke a little bit about how things are going right now with Warner Brothers Discovery and how this relates to Cartoon Network and more so Adult Swim. And essentially what he was saying is that the merger was rough in the beginning, but now we have our footing set, we have a bright future ahead of us, and we have a path ahead to the next generation of animated content on Cartoon Network and Adult Swim. But the one thing in that that article which a lot of people are stopping at and talking about is that in the article he casually drops that Adult Swim is expanding by an hour. So as we all know for years now Cartoon Network has been signing off at 8 p.m. churning over to Adult Swim which then ends at 6 a.m. In the past in the early 2010s and the late 2000s it used to be 10 p.m. and then 9 p.m. and then it was cut back to 8 p.m. obviously which in my opinion real quick I really feel like ending at 8 p.m. is way too early for Cartoon Network. Kids are still watching at 9 o'clock. I feel like 10 o'clock was the perfect time to shift over to Adult Swim. So now all of a sudden in the article, like I said, Michael Olin said Adult Swim is going to expand by an hour. So guess what that means? Cartoon Network is now going to end at 7 p.m. every day and Adult Swim will pick up at 7 p.m. and go all the way to 6 a.m., which to me is kind of just crazy that Adult Swim is now going to be starting every single day at 7 o'clock. That is really early for Cartoon Network to sign off. I am kind of scratching my head at the whole announcement. To me, it just doesn't make much sense. It seems like we're kind of coupled with everything that happened last week, right? Coupled with the fact that Unicorn Wars Eternal is moving to Cartoon Network to Adult Swim. Same thing with My Adventures with Superman. We obviously heard earlier in the month, or last month rather, that Batman Cape Crusader is moving from Cartoon Network to Amazon Prime Video. It just really seems like on top of all that, now that Cartoon Network is losing an hour of airtime, it seems like Cartoon Cartoon Network's taken the back burner at Warner Brothers Discovery for a lot of other things. It seems like Adult Swim is even more of a priority now than Cartoon Network. And I just really don't understand what the future of this brand is, given that the content that was being made for Cartoon Network, that was supposed to, you know, push Cartoon Network forward into the next era of the channel, My Adventures with Superman, Batman Cape Crusader, Unicorn Wars Eternal, all of these shows that people were looking towards saying, wow, that's going to be a great series to tune to Cartoon Network to see they're all being moved off the channel so it's like the only new shows off the top of my head that were highly praised or being highly you know looked forward to I should say were Total Drama Island Revival and then maybe a Yanu Child of Wonder those are the two series that are still hopefully coming to Cartoon Network and aren't being moved off the channel so it really makes me wonder like I said before what is happening over at Warner Brothers Discovery that we're now prioritizing Adult Swim and it seems like Cartoon Network's kind of taking the back burner they don't really care about it as much if Cartoon network wasn't a brand there would have never been an adult swim same thing goes for boomerang they're all spin-offs of cartoon network they all came from the cartoon network brand without cartoon network none of those channels none of those blocks would exist so i really feel like going forward they need to focus on cartoon network and find a way a path poured for the channel because right now it's not looking great for cartoon network we don't really have that many ongoing shows and it seems like the situation is only going to get worse because now if we have Total Drama Island Revival premiered this year on Cartoon Network, assuming it's not being moved off the channel as well. That's only one new series. We need a lot more than that to push Cartoon Network forward. On top of that as well, Michael Olin did state in the article that part of the reason why they're ending Cartoon Network earlier is because, according to their statistics, 68% of Cartoon Network viewers from 6pm to 8pm are over the age of 18, which I think is a pretty staggering stat that once 6pm hits, 68% of the viewership, they're a adults. The kids aren't watching the channel as much anymore. I'm kind of wondering if what they're trying to do right now with Adult Swim is if they're going to kind of create a pseudo block within Adult Swim that's kind of like a teen Cartoon Network. I know people for a while were saying, oh, Cartoon Network should have a teen channel, which I honestly agree with because there's Teen Nick and that was a great channel back in the day. Why not have like a Cartoon Network for teens? I've heard people dub it as Cartoon Network. I'm kind of wondering if that's what they're doing now, but just in the Adult Swim block. I'm wondering if from 
from like 7 p.m to 10 p.m every single day is going to be kind of cartoon network and adult swim combined together and what i mean by this is it's going to be shows that are meant for young adults or teenagers just under the adult swim branding maybe they'll create a whole new block within adult swim for this but this could be a place where shows like my adventures with superman air maybe they'll have reruns of older cartoon network series such as regular show or adventure time or maybe hey since gendy's back at cartoon network and we're getting primal on adult swim we're getting unicorn wars eternal on adult swim why not air some reruns of symbionic titan and maybe that could even lead into a season two because i know that's something a lot of fans including myself want and gendy's been on the record in the past saying he'd love to make more of titan i'm generally wondering if that's what they're doing here is cartoon network ending earlier and adult swim starting earlier going to create like a cartoon network for teens adult swim junior if you will something that's not meant for the really older audience that adult swim sometimes targets but maybe it's something that's meant for you know teenagers or even young adults honestly if that's what they're going for i think that could be great but right now that remains to be seen because right now the real story here is cartoon network's losing more airtime while also losing more content because the content's being moved off of cartoon network to adult swim in the case of my adventures with superman and unicorn wars eternal in the case of batman cape crusader it's straight up being moved to amazon so like i said before this is a really interesting situation and it's kind of head scratching i mean like i said it could all make a lot of sense if all of a sudden from 7 p.m to 10 p.m we're gonna have like a teenage cartoon network block but that's not what they're telling us right now that remains to be seen all we know right now is cartoon network's losing airtime and it's losing content and that just doesn't look good for the future of the brand the future of cartoon network the channel anyways let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about all this you guys surprised and disappointed to hear like me that cartoon network is losing an extra hour of airtime and would you be okay with it if they end up making 7 p.m to 10 p.m every day like a cartoon network for teen or adult swim junior if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to leave a like and subscribe to see more content like this from dc network thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time